Yo, 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 what's going on? And this is not going to be a long video. It's Terrell Hall of Fame D line, TBKC, and all that sweet, beautiful, wonderful. Shh. I'm just going to say this, man, and it's so much that happened today. So we have to do this because I got messages this morning from a friend of mine, which is like hilarious. Uh, I got to ask him, can I post this shit? Because it's hilarious. But anyway, like, He's not no old school breeder or nothing. He even flat out told Dave Wilson in a message. He's, he, uh, he he commented on Dave Wilson's post. Dave got in his inbox and started talking shit. So, but really all he did is talk shit and he capped. He went out and talked about, you know, lying to the dude. I'm just getting to the gist of the story, really. Homie told him, like, look, it, Dave, if you're talking all this shit, if you real on what you say it is, let's get a non-bullshit ass ABKC judge. Let's get a real judge. He said, and I'll take my dog that I got from Oscar Gomez against anything in your yard. He said, not only will I take my dog against anything in your yard, let's put up 10, even 20 grand. And I know the brother, that ain't no problem to him. So then he said, but it's one, it's one hitch. Because the debate started when he said, dog, your dogs can't even breathe. You ain't really got real dogs. What's a, what's a dog that can't breathe? He said, that bitch got to breathe. Now, I watched the conversation. Dave kept capping. First of all, Dave told a lie on Oscar, told a lie on me. First of all, I, I want to clear this. Don't y'all never let Dave tell y'all like he set my yard up. He didn't set Oscar's yard up. The true facts of the matter is, is yes, we were both in the Elite Edge. The Elite Edge wasn't Dave's group, first and foremost. It wasn't he, it was the, the he wasn't the president. It wasn't nothing. We all was in the group together. He wasn't doing no more than anybody else. And the reason why it's a razor's edge bloodline for real is because of the Elite Edge. So he captained like that. The truth of the matter when it comes to me, I never really got a Dave, uh, a dog off of Dave's yard, period. The, I'll, I'll tell you all the truth. I'll even pull him on and do an interview. I just talked to him like a month and a half, maybe two months ago. But I got my dog from Trevino's. Trevino's actually got middleman, whereas uh, Dave took uh, uh, Shamu, which he co-owned with a brother named Mike out in California. He sold the dog for a couple puppies back. The, the, the Trevino's did the breeding with the stud that they owned at that time, which was Thug. The Trevino's made Hallie. I did purchase the dog from Dave, but the the but it was the, actually their breeding. That's the way that went. So as far as a real dog off of Dave Wilson's yard, no, I never got it. Uh, I don't know what Oscar ever got off of Dave, but I know at the time, and I'm talking about we're dating back now over 20 years ago. I don't ever remember Dave, I mean, Oscar at that point in time, personally getting a dog off of Dave. You can look back in the pedigrees and see a razor's edge a couple generations, but it's weird for this dude to still be trying to claim like he made our whole careers when all of our dog, like nothing really comes directly from him. It's other shit that other people did. He claims, you know, he made Marco when the truth of the matter is Marco always did his own breedings and Marco actually got Paco off of Sean's yard. Dave, I think middleman that deal somehow, but n none of it, it, it doesn't matter. Like this dude hasn't done any breedings in 20 years. And the reason why he started talking all this extra stuff, and I don't want y'all to think I'm getting on it. This was in the message was bottom line is because the brother challenged him to say your dogs can't breathe. And he wanted to change the thing. Then it became Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm always in Virginia. So he didn't want to meet up nowhere or nothing like that. Now he wants the brother to come all the way to Virginia to see about him and this, that, and the other. When I'll tell y'all why, and it's a fact, can't none of them dogs breathe. Ask anybody who was around. This is factual. I dig up Bobby Dean's on the ass, and he'll tell y'all. Uh, Nori, that's always on uh, on this page and be commenting on real, he, uh, he was around back then. Well, a lot of y'all was around back then when they brought Demon Boy from overseas. The reason why Demon Boy fell flat and y'all don't see any Demon Boy shit and Dave still trying to pump that dog. When he came to the States, first and foremost, he did not look like the pictures. He was not nearly that bully. And then he was out there about to have a heat stroke within 10 minutes of being outside in Virginia. He was breathing hard. It was on the video. He got exposed. That's the reason why he never blew up like any of the other dogs. See, Bashar is oftentimes smart enough 
that he don't he won't let a person hear his dog breathe if, if it does that or whatever. Dave was stupid. They brought that dog out. His career ended. He talking about he big time in Europe. Dave, you're a fucking lie. In Europe right now, most people hate your guts, and that's why y'all can't do shows over there, and nobody's buying the blood over there. A lot of the people who bought the blood over there, their dogs have died and everything else. But it's a whole different thing. And then uh, I'm hearing about these posts, and this is what I'm doing. I'm going live, so I don't want to spill the whole thing on this. But, you know, Dave had a long day of lying, trying to once again say he made everybody, he did everything. Dave, you made no dog since Little Row. Nobody knows of a dog that you actually made since Little Row and uh, Kai Litter. No nothing that comes from you. Not shit that you claim, not middleman deals where you tried to get your hands on shit. No, you show me a dog that you actually made, that you whelped the litter, that it's in your yard. It was actually your breeding because you didn't even make Demon Boy. And we all know that. That was Sean Jackson's litter. You're a fucking fraud. And then you don't, talking about you don't want to take credit. The registry don't want to take credit for what happened to the American bully. You take credit for everything else. You started this, this, that, and the other. So the condition of the dogs is your fault. I don't get it. You know, he put up all these long and, and, and interviews and everything else. Tomorrow on live, I hate to do it to him, but I'm going to tear this bitch up. I'm going to tell y'all from the root to the toot. All of his lies, all of his bullshit. Y'all can check the videos. Go back 10 years to where he's telling y'all, oh yeah, now all of the dogs is Amstaffs and Bulldogs. Go back 10 years ago and watch the videos. I'm going to pull some of them, screen record them, and post them on this page since some of y'all think I'm bullshitting. I'm going to screen record the shit of when he was talking about, oh yeah, this is an American bully. It's supposed to be an Amstaff. And not no bulldog traits. We just want to make them healthier. Y'all notice the word health ain't even came out this bitch's mouth in about 10 years. But we're going to go in uh, real nice tomorrow, man. I'm going to catch up with y'all. Much love. Peace.